Welcome to week, or no, John, John 12. John 12. <laughs> We're in John 12. John 12, day one mm-hmm. today, and it's really good to be back with you. Um, I, Sharita, as we have looked at this today, we're just noticing some of the same characters. Yeah. Again. Yeah, yeah. so it's interesting with John 11, we're like, oh, I wish I knew what you know, Lazarus said right after. And we don't find out what he said, but we do see that Jesus is back with them. Mm -hmm. Um, And just some, I would say, not unusual behavior Mm -hmm. from some of these characters. Mm -hmm. Yeah, true. Okay. So taking, let's just take Martha. Yeah. Martha served. I know. I was like, of course she served. Like, that's how God wired her and created her Mm -hmm. um, with that servant spirit. Mm -hmm. And this is a way that she worships. And in contrast with what we've seen before, she doesn't get chided or reprimanded. Mm -hmm. Um, It seems like she does it in the right way here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree. And then there's Lazarus, whom Jesus raised from the dead. You made a yeah. point that John mentions that twice. He does in verse one and verse nine, just on day one. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, he's making it clear. Look here, people. Here's a big sign. This is mm-hmm. the Messiah. Yeah. We still don't get a feel for what Lazarus I know. has to say about the whole experience. Yeah. But we do see, I, I like how it said, and Lazarus was one of those reclining with him at the table. Mm. And just the idea that Lazarus is dining, feasting with the Lord yeah, after his experience. I mean, yeah. in the Middle Eastern culture, that is an expression of intimate friendship mm-hmm. to eat with someone. Mm-hmm. And so mm-hmm. if there was any type of uh, tiff <laughs> about <laughs> Lazarus having to die or having to come back. Um, It seems like any of that would have blown over because they're sharing a meal together. Jesus is welcomed back into their home. And so there's that relationship there. That's a good thought. Yeah, I appreciate that, Ashrita. Yeah. Okay, and then the last character here is Mary. Mary. Yeah. What Um, a beautiful expression of devotion. It is. And I think that, you know, I was thinking about as I read through this, it's it's one of the, it's sort of like the miracles. It's easy to skip over these stories that are familiar, mm-hmm. but just re-looking at it again and slowing down and taking a step back and just realizing the extravagance of her adoration. Yeah. And I think what stood out to me this time was her abandon mm. to, like, Culturally, women wouldn't just let down their hair. That's true. Only husbands would see you with your hair down. Mm. So the fact that she has her hair down, I mean, it's complete abandon. Yeah. It's so extravagant in many ways. There's nothing too much or too far. Right. Too out of reach to offer Jesus. It's so such devotion and... I don't know, to me, a beautiful act of worship. And in my own Mm. life, I'm always seeking to better understand what does worship, you know, what should personal worship, like this isn't in church, which I love, by the Mm -hmm. way, I love the worship. There's a place for that. Right, right. But what does just pure personal worship of the Lord look look like? Mm. That's a great question. Well, there is a fourth character here. There is. Yeah. And we see Judas Iscariot, who is always mentioned, always, as the one who betrayed Jesus. Mm -hmm. Like, the gospel writers are always careful to make Mm -hmm. that note. Mm -hmm. And so we see here almost like a a foreshadowing Mm -hmm. of what's going to happen. um, Because he looks at what Mary did and kind of scoffs at it. He really does. And, you know, as as I kind of contrasted the two, I saw Mary, who's offering was this beautiful fragrance that filled the home. Mm -hmm. And his complaint, I just imagined as a stitch. Hmm. You know, just thinking about the the fragrance of it and the difference there. That's a good contrast, yeah. Mm. Well, um, we're wondering, as you look at these Mm -hmm. dinner characters, which one of them do you identify with Mm -hmm. most and why? Yeah, let us know in the comments.